The 21-year-old who was detained in connection with the investigation into the leaked documents faces charges of willful retention of classified information and unauthorized retention and transmission of national defense information, both of which carry maximum sentences of 15 years in prison. On Friday morning in Boston, Massachusetts Air Force National Guard member Jack Dixera made his first appearance before a federal magistrate. Dixera entered the courtroom wearing a black t-shirt underneath beige pants and a smock. He was in handcuffs when he arrived, but they were taken off before he sat down at the defense table with his lawyer. Dixera appeared to scan the crowd from his seat for a moment. In a courtroom sketch from April 14, 2023, Airman Jack Douglas Dixera of the U.S. Air Force National Guard, who is accused of publishing highly sensitive military intelligence records online, makes his initial court appearance. On a bench in the front row designated for the defendant's family, three people were seated. Someone in the front row shouted, Love you, Jack, as Tixera was re-handcuffed and led from the court. The 21-year-old replied, Love you, too, Dad. Photo. After Jack Tixera's arraignment on April 14, 2023, in Boston, Jack Michael Tixera, the suspect's father, leaves the John Joseph Moakley Federal Courthouse with family members. Pre-trial detention was granted in response to Assistant U.S. Attorney Nadine Pellegrini's request, pending the conclusion of a hearing on Wednesday. On Thursday, Tixera was apprehended in Massachusetts in connection with an investigation into alleged unauthorized removal, retention and transmission of classified national defense information, according to Attorney General Merrick Garland. The U.S. Intelligence documents, which appear to contain top-secret information about the Ukraine war and other regions of the world, were reportedly shared among a small group of Discord users before becoming widely known, according to media reports. According to the criminal complaint, Tixera improperly and unlawfully retained and transmitted national defense information to people not authorized to receive it. According to the charging papers, the FBI spoke with an unnamed user of the Discord chatroom on Monday, where Tixera allegedly posted secret information. That person informed the FBI that the alleged leaker went by the name Jack, appeared to reside in Massachusetts, and had asserted his membership in the Air National Guard. According to the charging documents, the suspect was a white male who was clean-cut in appearance and between 20 and 30 years old, and he also claimed that he had spoken with him on video. Discord isn't specifically mentioned in the complaint, but the platform appears to have aided the FBI by providing the login information for the account connected to the leak. Dixera allegedly gained access to a government document on February 23rd and posted it the next day. The initial accusations are based on the disclosure of that document. In a statement released on Friday, President Joe Biden said he applauded the rapid action taken by law enforcement to investigate and respond to the recent dissemination of classified U.S. government documents. Our national security team is closely coordinating with our partners and allies, Biden said, while we are still determining the validity of those documents. I have directed our military and intelligence community to take steps to further secure and limit distribution of sensitive information.